In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys step-by-step -step how to actually launch your own viral successful meme coin. And we're gonna be going over everything like adding liquidity to the pool so it's tradable and everything like that. Now, as we know, a lot of people are becoming meme coin millionaires just off of launching their own coins. The reason is because you have the earliest entry and you honestly have the most control over if the coin goes up or not. Now, it is pretty confusing to launch your own meme coin and that's the whole reason of this video is to make it very simple for you guys. So with that being said, what is the first step? Step one is finding your meme coin that you actually wanna launch. Now, I base my launch off of a bunch of different factors but I'm just gonna give you guys three examples. The first one is how memeable is the meme coin is it cute funny or is it just relevant if your meme coin is funny or cute or anything like that then it will most likely do pretty well second is how relevant it is in the current time and space a lot of times there will be different trends going on so how trendy is your meme coin and what is the viral potential we want this to be pretty high so that your meme coin can gain easy traction just from people seeing it and being like yeah i would buy that and lastly is how good is it for a community based meme coin? So like how memeable is it? Can you make different variations of the coin? And is there kind of a top or is it able to just keep on making funny memes about your coin? Now, if all three of those things are done, the last thing you wanna check is if the coin has been done before. Now we're gonna be going on to Dex Screener and checking if a coin has been done before. Now for this video, I'm just gonna be creating any coin. It doesn't actually have to be that good because I'm just showing an example, but normally you do want to put some effort into your meme coin idea or it won't do that well. Now right now, as we could see, there's a bunch of different meme coins coming out, but what sticks out to me is Pigger. It's the Wigger Pig. This did blow up and I think that if we make a derivative, it could do pretty well. So I'm gonna be using Orient Tool for this video. Make sure you guys use them and the link will be at the top of the description below. But the first thing we're gonna do is come over to Token Creator and we're gonna add the name. So I'm gonna be doing a thug rat, and I can call it thug rat, and then I can call it thrug. So it's kind of like rug, thug, thug rat. It's kind of funny, I think that it will do pretty well. And then for the decimals, you can put six or nine, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna be putting nine, because we are probably gonna be putting a billion supply. And now for the image, usually you wanna do a 500 by 500 image. These do the best. Now they do have some instructions here if you guys don't understand, but if you watch this video, it does show you how to do everything. Now for supply, normally I would put a billion. There's different options like putting a million, 10 million, 100 million, but honestly a billion is the most well-known supply that people are used to. So let me just put, there you go, that should be, yeah, that's a billion. And for the description, it doesn't matter as much, but we could just put thug rat called thrug. And now this part is required, you need a revoke freeze and then if you want to, you could do revoke mint. And basically we will be doing this for the example because what this allows you to do is increase token supply. So we're gonna be basically revoking this, making sure that the people who buy our coin feel more safe. Now we've got our wallet loaded up, so I'm just gonna select wallet, do this and continue and now we're gonna press create token. Now yes, this does cost 0.5 Solana, but this is all worth it since this is much more better than anything like pump fun or anything like that. And I'm gonna show you guys why right now. So we've pressed create token, it's confirming the transaction, and boom, now we've gotten the token, and what we wanna do is create liquidity pool. So you're just gonna press it down here or go to this tab right here, and we're just gonna select our coin right here. And now normally what people want to do is create a liquidity pool, so I would usually do around 95%. Now the liquidity pool is required for your token to be bought by anyone and there's two different options. We have CPMM which is a little more on the cheaper side but obviously there is a fee tier for the people who are buying your coin. And then there's the more modern way which is AMMV4 which basically means that there is no fee for people buying your coins. Now for this video we are going to be using AMM and I would recommend you guys use that for most of the time. Now we're gonna come over to select coin and we're just gonna be doing max. Now quote token is basically the starting price of the token, so you can put however much you want, but for this example, I'm just gonna be putting 0 0.01. And also I would recommend that you put around 95 over here just because you wanna do 95%. So most people are actually, you know, not scared to buy this coin and this is what makes it more secure on Dex Screener. Now we're gonna press initialize liquidity pool 
And then there's one more very important instruction after this, which I'm gonna show you guys how to do. And basically this will verify that your coin is safe to buy for other people. So transaction confirmation, it's still loading. Let's just give it a second and boom. Now we're gonna go over to burn tokens and we're actually gonna burn the tokens for this coin. We're gonna go over to liquidity pool radium and we're just gonna press burn. Now this is irreversible, so remember that. And basically it's gonna burn all these tokens that we just created for this coin. All right, now that it's burned, we should be able to look at the coin on deck screener and actually see that it is safe to buy for people. So as you guys can see, we do have our coin right here. And we are actually getting some buys and sells already, which is pretty cool to see. Now in a few minutes, our coin will actually show that it is safe to buy like these other tokens. So I'll show you exactly what I mean. Basically, it shows this symbol right here, liquidity locked or burned. And basically, we just burned it. So it will be showing that soon over here. Okay, it's been a couple minutes and now you guys can see our coin Thug Rat or Arth Hug has actually been liquidity locked, which is good. This basically means it's safe for everyone to buy and any good traders are gonna buy this coin now. And as you guys can see, we actually did have some good volume right away. So it went from zero all the way up to around $400 of liquidity in this coin. Now, obviously, if you did want to kind of make it better, you're gonna have to do things like buying decks and advertising the coin, but this is actually how you can launch your coin from zero to something using Orion tools. Now make sure you guys do rewatch the video if you are confused. A lot of the steps are very important and if you do them wrong, you can actually end up screwing up your token. But you can see we actually were able to successfully launch our coin and now is kind of where we would want to start buying supply, advertising and everything like that.